Hey guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for coming back to the channel. This is Scott from Hidden Valley Homestead. Guys, this is a place that I passed on the way up to our place in Idaho last year. And I about broke my neck, rubber necking this place. Uh, I had to stop and turn around and come back and see this place. If you guys love dozers, this video is for you. You've got to check this place out. Tag along. So here we are guys at Century Farm. And this guy has all of these dozers. All of these dozers all lined up out here. 1939, he collects them and he restores some of them. I met this guy, his name is uh, Orville, I think. But look at this, look at these old dozers. It was a 30, Caterpillar 30. Okay, so for all of you dozer freaks like me, this place is awesome. I'm not gonna tell you where this place is, okay? You guys know where it is? You guys leave it in the comments section. But I'm not telling you where this place is. It's on the way to Idaho. I'm not gonna tell you where. This is a 1948 TD-14. McCormick Deering, 1937. Look at these things. 1940 TD-9. There's a 1950 cat. He's got the dates all stenciled on these things. There's a 1948. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh. I love this. Another 14. Look at that, 1948. That's a John Deere right there. Look at that beautiful old caterpillar. 1949. Let's go take a look at some of the ones he's got restored over here, guys. There's an old Cat 10. Look at that thing. That thing is cherry. And look at this John Deere 420. Oh my gosh. This thing is beautiful. Look. This thing is so cool. And he's got some other plastic stuff around here. You guys go, uh, there'll be another clip in here that shows you guys that John Deere that he restored. Perfectly, perfectly running. His, uh, he said his grandkids come in here and, and run that thing around the yard. Look at all these old ones over here. There's some more 40s, some 50s. A lot of these rolled logging. Logging dozers. McCormick Deering, 37. How cool is this? Look at this big beast right here, 1954. Yeah. Let's see if I can get a little bit better angle so the sun's not near you guys' eyes right here. Man, look at the wide tracks on these old, these old beasts. There's an old Alice Chalmers. Fantastic. Here we go. Here's some, here's some better. Uh, Got the crank start on the front. 1935 Alice Chalmers. Look at that thing. There's a 37 called a Martha. There's a 35, 1937 McCormick Gearing. There's Mary. Boy, that thing is cherry. Hoo wee! Let's look at this big 50, 1954, from the back side. Guys, this stuff is so cool. Old Alice Chalmers, check it out. There's a D2. I can't wait to get my hands on there. These things are laying all over Idaho. All over Idaho. Out in people's yards is yard art. A lot of them are in pretty good condition. I've seen a couple, I just passed one about 10 miles back. Somebody was using it to clear their land by their barn. Man, look at these things. These are so cool. <laughs> look at the wench on that thing. That thing is badass. <laughs> oh man, that's just dozer heaven right here. Holy smokes. 
Okay, guys. So I'm gonna post up some uh, some pictures and stills I took of a lot of these things, and uh, you guys can have at it. Screenshot it, whatever. There's a 15 right there. I'd love to get my hands on one just like that. That's a perfect size right there. And then, and then up there, there's, he's got some more. He got another old dozer and some more tractors. He's got a whole bunch up on the hill up there. John Deere Caterpillar. Two cylinder. It's got a flywheel. There's a seat way back there. Wow, look at this. The tracks in this thing. A Lindemann. 1946. I can find one of these, baby. 